Okay, so I kind of just, you know, thought of doing this video just as like, I don't know, book review kind of thing, I guess. I don't know. No, it's, it's whatever, I guess, but it's basically just going to be about the Gothic Charm School book. Um, so, yeah, I'm not going to like, you know, read everything, obviously, because that would be like, you know, what would be the point of you guys getting the book if uh, I just, you know, read it all in <laughs> this video? Um, and I'm guessing it would be like, you know, she could probably take down the video then if I did that. And also it's like, I don't want to like take away from income or whatever, like her making money. So, you know, I'm not going to do that. I'm just going to be like, hey, if you, whatever, then get the book, because, you know, obviously, I'm not gonna try to, like, take away money source from someone, <laughs> so, you know, I'm not gonna go through everything then. Um, I'm just gonna talk about, like, you know, whatever. Um, so I guess I will start off saying that I guess this book is for pretty much anyone, I guess. If you like goth people, or you like the goths, whatever, if you are a goth yourself, or you know someone who's goth, or you just like it, or, you know, I mean, I guess anyone who likes goth stuff is goth, I guess, technically? I don't know. But, like, um, if you have a family member or a friend who is goth, then this works, too. I, I would also say that if you are scared or you hate goth people, you're scared of goth people or you hate goth people for whatever reason, then you should probably read this book because it's, you know, it explains a lot of stuff. <laughs> I think that's kind of the point of this book is that it explains a lot of stuff that has to do with being goth and like the whole goth culture, aesthetic, you know, area and whatever. So, you know. But yeah, um, there's also the Gothic Charm School, like, website, and like, I'm pretty sure, yeah, there's the Tumblr, and then also there's the YouTube channel, I'll probably put the YouTube channel in the description, but yeah, if you want to get this book already, then, you know, you can just look up Gothic Charm School, and then I'm sure the book will come up, I, I, usually it's one of the f top few things that comes up when you look it up, so, or it should be anyways, so, you know, anyways, but yeah, so, like, you know, obviously there's always the start thing where it talks about the author and whatever, and then on the back it also talks about whatever, where it's, like, a, a guidebook thing for goth stuff, um, and then it talks about a little bit of the author there, and yeah, so then there are the uh, I guess chapters. So the first one is just an introduction and whatever, so it talks about, like, I guess getting into it and, like, what you should know first, probably. Um, and then, so, you know, there's that introduction thing of, like, talking about whatever. Then chapter one is Am I Goth? And it's kind of just, you know, whatever about, like, the subculture and stuff like that and whatever. Um, and then chapter two is I'm not goth but I have some questions about them and it talks about like misconception misconceptions and stuff like that so you know I'm talking about all of this different kind of stuff there too um and then chapter three is about baby goth so if you are under 18 and you're goth then you're a baby goth or it could be someone who's just starting out in the goth area of stuff. Um, so you could be an adult and be a baby bat or baby goth or whatever and um, you know, you'd still be called a baby goth um, or a baby bat or whatever. So yeah, there's that. And then it also talks about like if your kid is goth and whatever. So yeah, um, I think, I mean, I'm pretty sure it talks about, yeah, goth parents raising goth kids and stuff and all that so yeah and then chapter four is um help i'm a goth and my parents friends slash p 
parent or friend or significant other or a coworker doesn't understand me. So, you know, it could be anyone that's like, could be hateful or just like fearful or whatever that this person has gone through or whatever. So it could be, yeah, parents or friends or partners or coworkers or n even neighbors or something like, you know, and it just talks about how like, you know, more misconceptions and cliches and stuff like that where it's just like, you know, <laughs> dealing with stupid people basically. Um, and then chapter five, it talks about goth cliches and why they are like, I guess so massive and whatever. So, you know, I'm sure we all know about stereotypes and stuff. Um, and then chapter six, there's goth and uh, romance. So I guess it talks about like you dating and getting married and stuff like that. Uh, chapter seven is, you know, socializing with people and doing all that. And like, I guess more of like what you should do and like, if someone's being mean to you, then just, like, ignore them, basically, kind of thing. Uh, chapter 8 is, um, fashion. And it's like, you know, fashion is massive for goth stuff. Chapter 9 is, um, dance the ghost with me. It's music and goth clubs and concerts and stuff. So, you know, music is another big thing with the whole goth area of stuff and you know talks about like listening to music and going to concerts and stuff and clubs and whatever and then chapter 10 is where do we go from here and it's kind of just whatever i guess so yeah that's kind of all of that so if you are i guess interested in any of those then you know get the book i guess and i think it'll really help anyone who's trying to understand this whole thing so yeah you can also watch the videos that they uploaded on their channel and yeah so anyways i guess that's kind of it but uh yeah i would recommend this for anyone who's trying to get into this and like understand it better so yeah anyways i guess that's it so bye